everybody. I hope you're having a great Tuesday. That means it is time for Tuesday Talks. And this week I have the absolute pleasure and delight of interviewing a brand new consultant I have never met before, Amy Melrose Gingrich. So I'm super excited. She's going to join us live now. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can add her to this video so that you guys can hear all about convention, all about the new product, all about everything from her because she was there live. So let me see if I can just grab her. So Amy, if you can request to join, there's a little camcorder in the bottom of your screen with a plus sign, go ahead and hit that and see if you can hop on here. Okay, yep, okay, see that report. Second. Hey, Christine. Hey, Jordan. Thanks for joining us. Okay, so glad that you guys are here. So here we go. Thank you, thank you for joining us for Tuesday Talks. Here we go. Hey! Hi. How are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you doing? Good, good to see you. Nice to meet you as well. This is the first time we've ever spoke, so this is really <laughs> kind of cool. Thanks for inviting me. Super cool. Yeah, you're very welcome. Thank you so much for joining. So, Amy, let's dive right in. Do you mind introducing yourself and telling us a little bit about why you became a Redan and Fields consultant? Sure. So um, I'm Amy Gingrich and I have been a consultant. Actually, I've been in this business about seven years. So I work full time uh, for University of Phoenix in the Disability Services Office. I've been doing that for 18 years. I'm married. I have two adult kids. Um, we've been married uh, 30 years, just had 30 wow. years. Um, and you know, I needed, when I was 47, I needed something for my skin. I needed a night cream and an eye cream. And I had a friend who was having a party, facial party, and she invited me. So I was like, okay, I'll go. And I told my husband, I'm coming home with a night cream and an eye cream. And I came home with nothing because I could not stop thinking about everything. And okay. at the time, our son was 19 and he was struggling with adult cystic acne. They had something for him. They had stuff I wanted. And then the biggest thing was just hearing the heart of the doctors, honestly, um, with the build on program that they have where they're helping um, high school students who are underprivileged and just that, that the fact that there's no inventory and um, I didn't have to have parties, but I could if I wanted to. Those three things along with skincare were, are yeah. what got me. <laughs> and here I am. <laughs> oh my god, I love that so much. That's amazing. And I think that clearly if you've been in seven years, you've made a good choice here because you're still here. Your skin looks beautiful. Your hair is actually looking really gorgeous. Cannot even tell you about my hair. Right? I'm just like, holy cow, I don't even know whose hair this is right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I'm dying to know how was in-person convention because this whole month leading up to this moment, we've been inter or I've been interviewing different consultants and pretty much everybody was going to virtual and we were talking up how great the experience is like you're not really missing out. But now I'm having FOMO. I feel like I did. I did miss that. I mean, you did it. It's fine. It's still good. But I, I was just talking with some of my friends today who we were there. And honestly, there's just nothing like being there in person. Uh, um, I've been to virtual, I've been to in person conventions before, and, and they did a great job with virtual when we had to be virtual. Right. But just being there and seeing the people who you, you know, you kind of collaborate with over time, um, even some of your own team members that you get to know and, and sideline people who you work with and just being able to see everyone. I mean, seeing the doctors there in person and, and just you can see like they are they are legit. They are real. They are funny. Mm -hmm. They like to have fun. And just being a part of that, there is something that just brings such an excitement to you. I don't know what it is because I know I toyed with, oh, my gosh, it's expensive. I, yeah. I don't have little kids at home, but I have a husband at home and, and I toyed with, you know, 
I know we had a great time with virtual before. We could do something like that this year. And I'm so glad I went. Oh, good. I'm so glad you went too, because you're the first person I'm interviewing who actually has had that in-person experience. So can you tell me a little bit more about the new products? Because I know you have them in your hands. Mine are in the mail. Mine are coming. I thought they were coming today. And now it says Thursday. And ah. I've been watching for FedEx like out the window all day. I'm like, oh, there's FedEx. Oh, it's not coming <laughs> to my house. So can you share a little bit more? Yes, uh, and I will even, okay, so my little, you okay, know that's so ah! basically, no, I have them all, the, so the doctors came out with hair care regimens, and they've been working on it, I can't remember the number of, of years, and I'm not going to have a ton of specifics, because I'm still learning about it, and it's just so much like, oh my gosh, but I have the basics, so basically, there's two regimens, and their whole idea is, your scalp is your skin so let's start at the scalp and get that skin going and then that's going to go to your hair and the two regimens uh, okay my friend is on here batch of brownies girl two years they have been doing this for two years um but uh they have the two regimens so one is going to be helpful with um like for me i have thin hair i have fine hair and it just is lifeless so much a lot a lot of the time it's lifeless um so this is uh the volume plus shampoo and conditioner regimen and that is going to come with um a, a defensifying treatment so basically you're going to wash your hair you're going to do the conditioner um and then you're going to do this treatment afterwards and i i don't even use any mousse or anything um when i used it so i've used it twice i used it saturday because we got a sample and then um I used it again yesterday. So this is dirty hair. I worked out this morning, oh but God. we have a dry shampoo. That is awesome as well. Um, this dry shampoo is, um, it doesn't have a, a really bad smell. Um, it doesn't stay white in your hair. It's really nice. So the other, and I'm kind of going all over, sorry, because it's really exciting. So the other- no, you're okay. You're doing great. So we do have a question, just I'm going to pause you for just oh, a yeah. moment. Um, is it good for colored and highlighted hair? And will it yeah. change the color of your hair at all? Will not change the color of your hair. And that is one of the big things is it is also good um, for the color treated hair. So that was one of the big things that they wanted to have it. Yep. Yeah, I love that. Because so, as you know, most of us color our hair. So right. it's just important for us to have that technology in there that's going to help against changing the color. Because you right. spend so much at the salon, you don't want to have it change. So. Exactly. And that was one of the doctor's biggest things that they wanted to do um, is make sure that people with color treated hair would be able to use it. Yeah, amazing. So, okay, continue, Amy. I'm, I'm all ears. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> That's, no, it's okay. I'm good. We love questions. So the mm -hmm. second one is um, the Smooth Plus. So this regimen, shampoo and conditioner, and then a defrizz oil treatment. So this is going to be good for if you have full hair, dry hair, that dry brittle, um, someone who has that unruly sometimes curly hair, this is it for you. Um, and then this... Uh, defrizz oil treatment i need my glasses no, um, okay. so this is gonna help with that um so those are the two regimens that they have and or that we have and then i told you about the dry shampoo and then this is a defined curl cream define plus curl cream so this again for the curly hair people but also if you curl your hair with the curling iron and then you can put some of this and then you can work with your curls. Now, I am not a hairstylist at all whatsoever, yeah. whatsoever. But they did um, some great. So they partnered with Bridget. I'm not going to remember her last name. Um, Bridget but, Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Bridget <laughs> You're welcome. And she is um, a hairstylist of Hollywood folks. And so she did a full presentation and actually did two different people's hair, persons, two different hair. <laughs> Um, and one um, was using this curl cream and she was helping with the curls to just kind of tame them down. And um, 
anyway, it was super cool. She's, she's awesome and really uh, helpful giving those stylist tips. So again, I'm not a stylist to know anything. Um, I'm just glad that I, we have access to these products because I normally go through um, any of my friends or I used to sometimes go with my mother-in-law to her place. She was a hairstylist back in her day and, you know, try and get the fancy hair shampoo conditioner. And then if I don't have any of those, I go to Target and get whatever. So now I'm glad to have access to this. And I, I mean, I cannot even say enough. I, I had reservations, honestly. I was like, really? Okay, so it's not a regrowth, but how are you gonna make my hair fuller by me just washing it? And like, I can't even believe this is my hair. So it's, it's so beautiful. Your hair looks gorgeous. And the it results are, gorgeous they say instant and over time so i'm really excited i was so excited to use it i forgot to take a before photo but it's okay it's just two two uses so i'll take one when i wash it before i wash it again yeah um, so you still have time. time yeah one so of the other biggest things i wanted to say about it too is you know when you walk out of the salon and you get your hair done and and you're you feel so clean and the shampoo is so good and you just feel like oh that is how i felt after i washed my hair oh my god that's, <laughs> that's amazing that Go ahead, sorry. Light, clean feel. I'm so excited to get these products and smell them and actually work with them and use them because I think that is what really matters. And so we have a question, will there be samples? So yeah, go ahead. Samples. Okay, <laughs> so this is a sample of the um, curl cream. And then you get, we have samples of the regimens so look how cool this is this package so pretty so this is a sample of the regimen oh it's gorgeous yeah so you get the shampoo the conditioner and the oil treatment in this one um the other sample i used but you get the same thing for the purple i call it the purple one so you can also get samples of the volume plus where you get the shampoo the conditioner and the defensifying treatment okay amazing <laughs> The only thing we don't have a sample of just for everybody to know is going to be the dry shampoo and right. that's refresh plus and that's because it's an aerosol and there's no way to actually package a sample of that so just that would be for right everybody to know and yeah exactly so okay i see you christine i see your comments she says i want samples of all of them amazing <laughs> so she's excited so um so Amy, I'm dying to know, now that you've told us about the products, you told us about convention, how exciting it was, what do you think that having this new, uh, these new hair care regimens and these hair care products are gonna do for your business? Like, what does that look like, do you think? Well, honestly, you know, I've been, I've just been trying to think about that because I get, you know, we've been so excited about what is this new product going to be? And I feel like it just opens to a whole, new market a whole other market that we have of people that we're able to help you know some people have a certain skincare that they like they like their regimen or maybe they just want lash boost but basically we are able to help someone literally from head to toe because we've got the hair we've got brows we've got lashes you can do your skincare you've got active hydration body replenish that's going to take care of your body so you know you're basically able to help someone head to toe. I think that's so important. And I really feel like when we look and feel our best is because of the products that we use. Like when I trans, I, you don't know my story, but my skin was so, so sensitive. And mm. I thought I just had to live like this. I kind of have a similar story as like Jamie Kern Lima in a way, but I oh. didn't have rosacea. Okay. And so my skin was so bad that I just was like, this is normal. And then when I tried Soothe, I was like, holy macaroni, in five weeks, I went makeup free. And I think about our hair as well. You know, a lot of people are hiding their hair. And I heard this so much at convention, well, virtual and through social media, is people were actually wearing their hair curly when they hadn't done it for years and years because of these products which mm -hmm. that makes me excited. That makes me excited that you're happy to live in your skin and in your truth. 
And so that was just like groundbreaking for me. Mm -hmm. Did you kind of have that same experience at all? Yeah, I would say for me, it was so I'm lazy with my hair. <laughs> I'm, I'm super lazy, honestly. And so I just don't want to do a bunch of stuff to get it ready. Um, but I was able to even wear it straight where normally to wear my hair straight, it just looks lifeless. So yeah. like the, the day after, so Sunday, I washed my hair Saturday morning, all day convention stuff, Saturday night, little big town. They were awesome. I had m sprayed my hair with hairspray multiple times during the day, casino smell, smoke smell, yucky. I thought for sure, I'm just going to put a hat on in the morning. I'll go home. I'll shower my hair, wash my hair later. I went to put my hat on and I was like, Hmm, I'm going to see if I can do something with my hair. My hair was still full. I could comb through it where normally if I've got too much, uh, what is that hairspray and all that, I wouldn't be able to have combed through it. So I was shocked. I thought for sure I was going to be wearing my hat home. So just for, for me, that would be it. I have very thin hair, you know, where you can like see the scalp. Yeah. And, um, I've just, I've noticed a difference that, it's 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 better it's getting there oh wow that's amazing thank you for sharing that so now my last question is i just am dying to know what advice would you have for anybody that's considering either trying these products or even considering trying the business opportunity for Renata fields because now this is a new category these are new products that we haven't done before so i just kind of threw that in there as well but like what advice would you have for someone Okay, um, I would just say for anyone, whether we've got a new product or not, it never hurts to get information. If you have someone that you're watching and you're like, hmm, how, what are they doing? How are they doing this? Ask them, reach out to them and just ask the questions because you never know. I mean, I, I did not ever think I would do a direct sales. I had done um, something in my 20s previously and I was like, I am never doing that again. But I asked questions because I kept watching and I kept seeing and I thought, hmm. And you know, that's the only way you're gonna find out if it's a fit for you or not. You don't know until you ask. Um, and even I had a student today that I was helping for my day job and she had a question and I was able to help her and she didn't know if I would be able to help her or not. And she said, you know, I've just always got to ask. And I mean, that can go in everything. She knew I was going to maybe tell her no. So maybe, maybe it's not going to be a fit for you, but how do you know that until you find out? And just with having a whole new entire product line with more to come, they kind of hinted at that. They definitely did. Definitely is a time to look into this opportunity. If it's something that's been kind of tugging at you a little bit, definitely time to ask. Absolutely. Oh my gosh, Amy, it has been so nice chatting with you, getting to know you and getting to know your perspective on convention and these new products. So I want to take a moment here to thank you for hopping on Tuesday Talks. It's been so fun. And so if you guys are watching this either live or on the replay have any questions for Amy or myself, feel free to direct message us. Our message boxes are always open. It's no strings attached. We just want to get you the information that you need. So no matter how big, how small the question is, feel free to reach out to us. And so thank you so much, Amy, for joining. And we'll Thanks talk for soon. Yeah, you're welcome. Bye-bye. Bye. Have a good one. <laughs>